little bit, but this is uh, basically an alert to you all who want to participate in research yourselves. And this is um, a brand new study which is being um, run by Brianna Stubbs, um, uh, who you, you, you will come to know over the coming months and years. Uh, and this is a study which is called MOVE, which we have launched. Um, and this is a human study on aging and exercise. And MOVE stands for Molecular Optimization via Exercise. We want you to volunteer for this. Now, we can't take everybody, so it's competitive, OK? <laughs> uh, but um, we want to, to recruit you and understand better how exercise makes uh, us healthier, uh, live longer, and delay various uh, conditions associated with aging. Now, this is a very busy slide, which is outlining a lot of the features which we're doing in this study. But we're going to take muscle biopsies from people who volunteer for the study. We're going to measure everything in these people, like a, a huge amount of uh, different molecular uh, readouts. We're going to look at mitochondrial function. We're going to look at a whole array of different metrics uh, and then try and contrast people who exercise you know, moderately, which will be some people in this audience, versus elite athletes. Now, those elite athletes have astonishing uh, uh, physical parameters, which distinguish them very, very dramatically from the, uh, you know, quote unquote, normal person. Um, and so we're hoping to understand what is different at the molecular level from these elite athletes versus the, the you know, the non-elite uh, human specimens, which would be people in this audience. Some of you may be elite athletes. I should say elite older athletes. So we're interested in people over the age of 65. So that's MOVE. So you can find more about that at the QR code and, and um, submit your interest there. Um, okay, so now turning to the main topic here. Now, we're going to start this